everybody. In this quick video, we're going to look at how you can do uh, calculate combinations, either SatCrunch or Excel. I'll just use this question as an example. We're going to do it twice. We're going to calculate seven combination five and seven combination two, uh, just for the sake of repetition, I guess. So let's open up StatCrunch. Okay. And let's see. Um, and the total number was seven. And we are going to be choosing, oops, sorry, R is going to be five. You don't have to type these two in here. This is just to help us remember. I have the memory of a dying goldfish, so I wanted to put it in there. Um, but one way or the other, you're going to go to data, compute, expression. And in the expression box, you're going to type in COMB for combination, open parentheses, type in the value for N, comma, the value for R, close parentheses, click compute, and there it is, 21. If you'd like to do Excel, the process is almost identical. Click at an empty cell, and in your formula bar, type in equals COMB and IN, excuse me, open parentheses, the value for N, comma, the value for R, close parentheses, and you get 21. Now, in this homework problem, we were asked to compare, um, where to go? We were asked to compare 7C5 and 7C2. So let's go ahead and do 7C2 uh, to see what we end up with. So stat crunch. I'll go to, I'm not gonna write it in, I'm not gonna write in R and N this time because you really don't need to. Let's see if I can remember. Uh, so you're gonna go to, where to go? Compute, expression, C-O-M, B. Seven is N, R is two. Compute, and then we got 21, what do you know? The Excel's me the same idea, doing equals, C-O-M-B-I-N, open parentheses, put your N, comma, value for R, close parentheses, enter. So it looks like 7C2 and 7C5 are identical. They both equal 21. So there are 21 ways to choose uh, five things from seven or two things from seven. Um, which isn't relevant to the, the StackCrunch and Excel portion of it, but hey, it's a cool fact. So that is how you use StackCrunch or Excel to calculate combinations.